Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name's Abby and today I'm back for another what I eat in a day video. I am back in the same spot as last time making a smoothie. Have a bagel going in the toaster. I already have my water berries and I'm gonna put my collagen in. Um, doo -doo -doo. Today is, let's say, today's Tuesday. I have one daycare kiddo here already. She's watching Daniel Tiger. Um, I don't like Daniel Tiger. I think he's very annoying, but she likes him, so I let her watch him sometimes. Um, I'm going to take some of these immunity vitamins. These go so fast. They're supposed to eat three gummies. It says there's 15 servings. I don't know. I swear I bought. I just bought some, but these might be the ones I just bought. I don't know. I feel like I go through those way too fast. Um. All right, I'm gonna blend up my smoothie once I. All right, I just gotta get. Just gotta wait for my bagel to be done. Um. It always pops, and then I have to flip it around and let it go a little bit more. Um. What was I gonna say? Oh, I went to the gym yesterday morning before work. Got a good workout in, so that felt good this morning. I was being lazy and slept in. I was probably asleep by nine o'clock last night, so there's no reason I shouldn't have gotten up. I set my alarm for 5.45, um, but I didn't. I slept until like 6.20, then I got a shower, and it didn't leave me any time to bike pedal or read my Bible this morning. So yeah, we'll see if I can squeeze that in today, or I'll just, um, I'll catch up on my Bible reading tomorrow, and I can, I'm gonna go to the gym tomorrow too, and then I can bike pedal Thursday. I don't know. Um, I'm not going to beat myself up for being lazy, but I'm going to try to push myself to not be doing that. Um, I just feel like I had such a good routine down. Last week was not the best week, but I had such a good routine down there for a while, and I don't want to slip back into it. Like, I get every now and then you have off day or even an off week, but I don't want to fully slip back into not getting up. So, we're going to work on that. Um, I don't think I have anything else to fill you in on. I'm still waiting. I don't know if I mentioned this, but um, November is my month to get inspected for daycare. And she still hasn't come yet. I mean, it's only the, what day is today? It's the 15th, so it's like halfway through the month. I just want her to come so I can get it over with. So maybe she'll come today. I don't know. We'll see. But I'm going to go drink my smoothie here's my bagel hang out with the kiddo until some more kiddos come and i will check in with you later hey guys it's a little after 10 drinking an alani rocket pop flavor kiddos are eating their snacks the snacks good yes bad snack what yeah. good snack no no yeah. i always sometimes at lunch i'll ask them good lunch okay lunch bad lunch so sometimes if I ask them how their food is, they'll go like this just to tease me because they say it's bad. It's not bad. Is it bad? Yeah. Yeah. What? Then I'll eat them. No. That's what I thought. I Baby's here. She took a little nap just a minute ago. She fell asleep probably a little after nine and I just woke her up a couple minutes ago. Um, but yeah, she's drinking this and I will check in with you later. Alrighty, it is like noonish. Um, kiddos are eating their lunch and I'm going to snack on this banana. Um, we had a pretty good morning. We did our letter E papers. We were doing letter E at circle time and after three circle times we do a paper. So I had them do that and we played, cleaned up, have lunch. We're having lunch now. So that's what's been going on. I'm feeding the baby. She's having peas and carrots and pears or something, but she's eating it. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Um, I will hop back on here when I make my lunch. Hey guys, the kiddos are all asleep. It's like quarter after one. Uh, so let's make some lunch.
the kiddos nap. Oh no, the baby's sitting up. All right, I gotta go, wish me luck. Hey friends, so it is about quarter to seven. Well, that just got really loud. Um, I'm sauteing some onions for dinner. I'm gonna show you what I make once it's all together, but I need to stir them. Um, it's, yeah, like I said, it's like late. It's kind of late. I went over to my dad's for a little bit and hung out with my brothers. And what else did I do? Um, oh, daycare. I need to update you. Last time, last time I left you, I was running because the baby was sitting up. Um, so she, I tried, I got her back to sleep, laid her down, woke back up again. So I just held her. I had to hold her for pretty much the whole nap time. And I had to eat with her on my lap and it was fine though. I don't mind the snuggles. I just was like, really wanted to eat my lunch in peace, but it was fine. She just snuggled with me while I ate and didn't drop any food on her. So that's good. Um, then we snuggled the rest of the time and then everybody left and it was a good rest of the day. I am going to eat my dessert right now though. I'm going to have a couple butter crunch cookies while I wait for my dinner to cook. Um, yeah, that is pretty much all that's going on and I will hop back on here once dinner's ready. Alrighty friends, so here's what we're doing for dinner. I have um, one of my homemade tortillas here. The skillet's warmed up. I have some olive oil sprayed on the skillet. I'm gonna add a little bit of Great Value mozzarella to one side. And then I'm gonna add, I have some chicken here. And then I put on some of this G Hughes um, hickory barbecue sauce. So I'm gonna put some of that on there. Okay, I'm doing this one-handed because I'm holding the camera. Okay, and then I'm gonna add these sauteed onions. They're a little burnt, but that's okay. I kind of like things burnt. There's um, one in there. I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna sprinkle the top with a little more cheese. All right, there it is. I feel like I need to maybe spread it out a little bit more. All right, and now I'm gonna fold over the side. Need to get a skill or a spatula. I'm just gonna kinda push it down a little bit. And I'll cook it on this side and then I'll flip it over and cook it on the other side and I'll show you when it's done. Alrighty, here is the finished product. And I just threw on some grapes to have with it. Alrighty, friends, that dinner was really, really good. I wasn't in the mood for just a plain chicken quesadilla and I ran out of um, the Chick-fil-A sauce that I used in the last video and I was like, how can I spice up this food and still use the chicken and still use the tortillas because I really don't want to waste them I thought of barbecue sauce and onions that was oh it was so good I've kind of grown to like onions I don't know why I just really enjoy some sauteed onions on things I don't have any more onions though I had just the onion I had part of it was bad but I just cut off the parts that were good and used that um but tomorrow night I have church dinner Thursday I'm supposed to go get sushi with a friend I'm hoping that pans out so I won't need to actually cook dinner until Friday so I might excuse me go to the grocery store after work and then I can pick up another onion and make some more but I don't think the chicken will still be good I might have to throw the chicken out because actually it's like a week old it's probably not even good right now I don't know I cooked it a week ago yeah I probably should throw it away but the tortillas are still good so I don't know anyways maybe I can do like a hamburger type thing with um the onions and I have some hamburger meat in the fridge I don't know we'll think about it um what else was I gonna say um what time is it it is like 7 20 oh i didn't eat the other cookie i only ate one cookie so i'm gonna eat the other cookie now and then in like about eight i have to go over to my friend's house and let her dog out um for her she is actually in the hospital right now it's the second time she's been in the hospital in the last couple weeks so if any of you wouldn't mind praying for her she could really use that um yeah so if you're the praying kind please pray for my friend that she would get better because she's been um battle in some sickness um just run over and do that and then i want to get to bed early because me and my other friend are going to the gym in the morning uh i'm gonna pick her up at 5 30 and we're gonna go um it's funny because when i go to the gym so early in the morning i just kind of like forget that i went but i still got the workout in and it's just like it's so nice because i went yesterday morning and 
by the time like nine o'clock rolls around I'm like oh yeah I did go to the gym this morning yes I'm getting these like workouts in and it's not like a stressful thing where I have to try to fit it in in the evening or something so getting up is a pain but having a workout buddy has been great these last couple days oh, I have something in my teeth um so I'm hoping we can both stick with it and not let the cold weather deter us once it starts getting colder. About an hour north of us, it was snowing, but it was raining here. I'm so jealous of the people that got snow because I love snow. But I'm going to try really hard to not let the cold weather stop us from going unless the roads are, like, really bad or something. Um, yeah, so gym tomorrow. We'll probably go Friday again. And then I'll get my three workouts in for the week. My goal is to get up at the right time on Thursday so I can have Bible time and do my pedals because like I said this morning, I did not do that. And it wasn't because I was like genuinely exhausted. I was being lazy. So we're gonna stop being lazy and get up. Um, I've really been liking doing my workouts during the week and then Saturdays, I don't feel like I have to get a workout in or anything. I can maybe go for a walk if I want to, but I don't have to work out. I used to always be like, well, just you have to work out Saturday because then you have at least one day in and it's like, I've been liking my Saturdays just to be chill days. So I'm going to try to keep up with that. But I've just been rambling, rambling, rambling. Um, I'm going to stop now. But thank you so much for watching this video. If you did like it, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. I love hearing from you guys. I'm trying. I think I'm falling into a pattern of posting every Monday and Thursday for now. Um, I'm really going to try hard to stick with that. I think my next video is going to be a weekend vlog. I'm going to start filming um, probably Friday. I might do Friday night again if I go to the grocery store so you can see another grocery haul. If I even get a bunch of stuff, I don't know. We'll see. Um, but I do plan on filming this weekend. And I'm going to say this, but hopefully I stick with it even though I don't say it. The video should come out Monday. I plan to edit it and get it out to you Monday. That's the plan. That's the goal. So we will see. But I will um, catch up with you then. Did I ask you to please like and comment down below? If I didn't, please do that. If I did already, I'm sorry for asking twice. Uh, press that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed already to my channel. Come find me over on TikTok and Instagram. I hit 13K. I hit 13K on TikTok. That's exciting. Um, uh, anyways, so I will see you guys next time. Bye.